past couple of years, video has taken over content on every single social media platform. So how do you make the most of the work that you've already done and repurpose your video and YouTube content to create an effective content marketing plan? Hi everyone, it's Leanne Cohens here, Digital Success Coach and owner of the agency Marketing Leap. And my passion is to actually demystify digital marketing for business owners and entrepreneurs through done-for-you practical marketing solutions that actually work and will springboard your business to success, as well as education and training and courses that actually give you marketing clarity and confidence when it comes to actually growing your business online. So all the information that I share in these weekly videos I've been doing from through my agency, Marketing Leap, and for my clients for years. So I know this works and I know it's really effective. So you've probably heard me and every other marketer out there go on about the virtues of video. And it's not all hype and it's not going away. There isn't much that you can't do using video. So whether it's expanding your reach and your exposure to actually helping your target audience to fall in love with your brand or the business or the people behind your brand and your business and your company. So unless you're actually working as a full-time YouTuber, you generally don't have the resources to produce a really involved, intricate series of videos every single week. And the good news is that you don't have to. You know, you may already be producing a whole stream of material for other channels. And you can actually do this by creating one video every single month. Now, here's how and what we're going to talk about is how to turn one video into separate pieces of content for your marketing plan. So the first thing that we do, whether it's you know for Marketing Leap or even for our clients, this is actually a service that we offer, is that we will actually turn their videos into blog posts. So even though video rules the, the, the internet, blogging is still here to stay. I'm going to show you what that looks like. So, you know, frequently updating your blog is one of the best ways to keep Google happy and to attract new prospective customers and clients to your website. So what we do is we get the audio of the actual video that's been done and we have it transcribed using a tool like Rev or Otter AI and actually convert that into blog posts. So to further, um, you know, do that, we add in, as you can see here, some subheadings, some photos, and make sure that we're sticking to the right Google keywords that we want to be found by. And then to further boost the uh, SEO power, what we do is we actually link or embed the YouTube video pertaining to this particular blog within the blog. Now, one of the best ways or best reasons for doing this is because the watch time, if it's embedded, the watch time that you have here will actually add to your watch time on your YouTube channel. And that is really important as far as working with the YouTube algorithm to get found. So the other thing that you can do, as well as using the um, transcript to create your blog, is once the blog is done, what you can do is then put the link into your description on the actual YouTube channel itself. So in your YouTube description, so you can actually see here, check out the full blog. So immediately you've got two ways of, if someone finds you on YouTube, you say you can send them to the blog. If they are reading your blog, they're actually watching the YouTube and that helps when it comes to increasing your, your views. Now, the next way is to post the content on social media. So you don't have to be on every single channel. You simply have to be where your ideal clients are. So what we do is, as I said, we do the live video that gets downloaded, that gets edited. The transcript gets turned into a blog and we then go back to different social media channels and create posts from the actual video text and from the transcript and create content that way. You can create carousel graphics, you can use Instagram or LinkedIn to show these. And if you have some really pertinent tips and that you can put out there, you can actually create a succession of frames inside one article so that every slide then contains one tip or a little bit of information based on what you're talking about with the video. And then you can also, you know, like I said, go through the transcript and use that. Now, the third way is to 
get it out to your mailing list. And this is again, really easy to do. Now, what we do is we again, take the thumbnail. Now it's probably best not to, well, it's not best to embed the video in, but what you can do is use the, the thumbnail of the image that you use and then link that to your YouTube channel. So the minute the newsletter goes out, people click on the image, they go straight to the YouTube, YouTube channel and they can view the video that way. That's what we do. We, as soon as the, the it's uploaded onto YouTube, we then create a bit of a newsletter detailing some of the most important points in the video and then add that link with the thumbnail so then people can go straight to the YouTube channel and watch it that way. And then the fourth way is that we then create a LinkedIn article. Now, obviously we're doing this for a marketing agency. So we are on pretty much every single platform. For a lot of business owners, you don't need to be on every platform. You simply need to be where your ideal clients are. So if your ideal clients are on Instagram, you can actually use Instagram TV and upload the video into Instagram TV. Make sure that you tick the box so it pulls through on your feed. You can do a story saying, you know, new video or a new post just gone live that people can click and go straight through to watch the video again. If your ideal clients are on LinkedIn, then you can create posts in LinkedIn and also add it into your article or create a LinkedIn article as well. Just giving them a bit of a short summary with a link back to the blog or with a link back to the video, depending on where your ideal clients like to hang out and how they like to consume the content that you put out. So, uh, and a great thing that LinkedIn is doing now is allowing you to create, to turn your articles into newsletters, but that's information for, that's a whole new topic that we can, we can talk about further down the track. And then of course, the fifth and final thing that you can do is actually curate and transform this video into several short form videos. So, you know, reels and, um, you know, with, the, with TikTok starting, there are more and more social media platforms that are almost highlighting and, and forcing business owners to post bite-sized video content. And that includes, you know, YouTube now has YouTube clips, TikTok, and of course, Facebook and Instagram have now got reels. So there's plenty of ways that you can actually cut down your lengthier videos into smaller segments. And from there, use those as reels and, and extra content into your social media channels. And that will actually give you weeks worth of content if you do it the right way. So you can also now upload videos to TikTok that are up to three minutes long. So you can even put more worthwhile information on your channel if you need. Reels can be anywhere from 15 to 30 seconds in length and YouTube shorts have a maximum runtime of 60 seconds. So taking snippets and using those is a great way way to use this content and then you can upload that into other video sharing social media platforms so you're putting a lot more different locations that your ideal client can find you using one live video that you've done and utilizing that content to the best of its advantage and maximizing it so and of course then you're showing up exactly where your ideal clients can find you so there you go there are the five ways that we use in the agency to repurpose content and you know if you are struggling to understand how video works and how YouTube works and you want to grow your YouTube channel and stand out I do have my business growth with YouTube marketing course online and it's fantastic as far as learning exactly how to set up your channel correctly how to edit your videos and how to actually use that content and get it out there so that you can actually grow your business it's a six module course and you walk away with a really clear understanding of how to use YouTube and videos in your marketing strategy. So like I said, you have your account set up correctly and you have plans and strategy in place to implement, to help you grow your channel, increase your sales and actually give you more time to spend doing the things that you love. So if that's of something that's of interest to you, I'll put the link to that below underneath this video now. But like I said, when it comes to repurposing your videos, the five ways are to turn your video into a blog post using a transcription service like Otter AI or Rev, post content onto social media, send it out to your email list through a newsletter, create a LinkedIn article, which can be converted into a LinkedIn newsletter for all your contacts on LinkedIn, or, or and what you should also be doing is transforming it into several short form videos that can then be used 
for reels and TikToks and YouTube clips and everything else that you're doing there. So I hope that has been of some value to you today. Now, if an online course doesn't quite suit you, I do have two spots available with my structured mentoring. It's a 12 week program and it's working one on one with you to actually give you clarity to generate leads and to stop you drowning in the overwhelm when it comes to marketing your business. So if that's something that's of interest to you, please reach out. We can have a bit of a chat and I'd love it if you join me next week as I show you how to monetize your YouTube videos. So in the meantime, guys, have an amazing week and I'll see you next week. Bye for now. If you'd like to learn more about how to grow your business online and how to thrive in the online space with all the different platforms that we have and different ways of creating and growing a business online, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button below as well as clicking on the bell so you get notified every single time we upload a new training video.